in there, but primarily it's a female. A lot of times I like to use a net, kind of like the U.S. with the glove. And um, so once you get your hand in the right place, you just hold as the perculum's tight. That was key. I want this to burn. Again, I'm looking at the, the papilla area right in here. Um, the first thing I'm noticing, I don't see that perpendicular line where eggs would come out. Okay? The first hole is the anus. Okay? What I'm going to do is I'm going to press a little bit and um, I should see some milk come right out, some sperm. bit of sperm, not much on these, which tells me this fish really isn't ready to reproduce. Um, so we can have them in here and we may never get fertilized eggs with this now. Well, where's the grill? Where's the what? The grill. The grill, yeah. Um, yeah, you might uh, vary the diet sometimes to get them a little better conditioning, ready to breed. Uh, and then about that fish, about that size fish, you might want to go ahead and get some food color and some dye to help you identify it a little bit better. Not see anything there. Uh, the animals are so small. gentle pressure and those eggs came right out. So that, that's a female that's ready to spawn. Okay? Now she's just waiting to advance with the male. Um, yeah. How many fish are in here, Bill? <laughs> okay, this is a female. As you can see, there's a perpendicular line in that region. Okay, and I'll press on her in a second, and you'll see that's where the eggs will come right out. That's pretty obvious. Eggs came right out. Definitely a female, no doubt about it.